Well, hello everyone, and welcome back to World of Warcraft for episode two, right where we left off. All right, Master Shangzi, Asa of the two, of the Tushvi, or Tushwi, I think it's Tushwi actually. Hey, in such a short time, you've shown me that you ha have the potential to be a great monk. The training grounds are behind you, but now you must prove yourself by facing a far greater challenge, one that none of my students have accomplished. I want you to to return to. Her. I want you to return to Huo, the Spirit of Fire, to the Temple of the Five Dawns. My two other most gifted students will help you in this task. The first is Asa, a cloud singer. Seek her out at the pool to the west. Speak to the merchant Lorville by Fu's Pond. That doesn't seem like I'm talking, like I'm speaking to the same person I was supposed to be finding. <laughs> oh well, we'll find them. Yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed part one of the series, or episode one. I, uh... I'm recording this immediately, as you can probably tell, I'm recording this immediately after I recorded the last episode. And, uh, yeah, so. Who all's online, by the way? Um, oh. He's online. I'll to check, check him out. Putting so soon? I'm envious of your prowess, monk. Good luck to you. Why, thank you, young friend. Actually, we got a new thing of handguards, didn't we? Let's equip those. Oh, uh, yeah. So we are building up our... I would like to see details. Thank you. Item level is... What item level are we? Item level zero of zero. Makes me sad. Some level two foxes. We should probably level up some. Let's test our prowess by killing, by beating foxes to death. I think I might go Brewmaster, just for the sake of being awesome. <laughs> I don't know. This, this is a DP, I, I'm thinking about a DPS build. I don't know. We'll, we'll have to see. Emberleaf Scamp. Okay, that was kind of weird. It's like running around with barrels of stuff. Here we are. There's Merchant Lovo, Lorvo. Ah, uh, there must be Asa out there in the pond. Shh, come quietly. She's practicing. I came to ask famous Asa Klausinger for help, but I can't bring myself to intrude on her exercises. She's so poised, so practice, so beautiful. You came for Asa? You you really shouldn't interrupt her until she finishes her exercises. She doesn't speak to anyone until her routine is done. In the meantime, could she maybe help me? I had some bad luck with forest brights. Okay, okay. Once. Emily of Scamp swarmed my cart and stole most of my training supplies I was bringing it to the training grounds. I've always... Yeah, let's see. I'm turning out that they've always been troublemakers, but they've never been this aggressive before. I don't know what happened. Please help me recover my supplies. Six train supplies from Emily's scamps. And the other one is a missing driver. And rescue the cart driver. We can get a merchant satchel and a cloak of compassion. Or cloak of the compassionate. So let's go ahead and we'll get those training supplies back. Hopefully hit level three soon. That'd be nice. And we'll get that new skill. And come on, wham! And of course, that one immediately comes up and attacks me. I wish I kind of wish I had an auto attack or more skills. I'm just so used to like spamming skills, and it's just like luckily these guys are only level two. Although I'm gonna have to recover. Oh, there we go. Die, you stupid s squishy things! I don't... I guess they're like... Oh, hey, there's level 3. And a new skill. Okay, Tiger Palm. One chi, instant, melee range. Attack with the palm of your hand, dealing 13 to 24 damage. You also grants you tiger power, causing attacks to ignore 10% of enemies' armor for 20 seconds. Stacks up three times. That's awesome. We need some chi to cast it, but... Okay, I officially like that. Let's take all these just stolen training supplies out. Alright, that's 4 of 6. Here's one. Tiger claw, tiger claw, tiger claw. Okay, one more. There's some over here. Might have to kill all of them, though. It's not a big deal, but... And... 
if we won't. That's rather nice. Okay. They are yellow, so I guess they only, they're supposed to attack when you attack something else, but oh well. Let's go complete this. Actually, let's go complete the other one. We'll go complete that one. Okay. Wait. Oh, he's way up there. Why is it not tracking this? It's not tracking the right one. No, it's not tracking it at all. Stupid. It's supposed to track the cart driver. Uh, is this the right way, right? Yep. It should be right up here. Oh, there he is. Nope, there will be no running away for you. Mr. Chang has trained you well. Thank you, my friend. I couldn't have fought them off alone. Now, if you'll excuse me, I should go find my cart. Alright, let's go complete both these quests. Cart! Okay, that's hilarious. <laughs> He's yelling for his cart like it's a... Like it's a... Uh, like a really... <laughs> Like it's an animal. That's hilarious. Uh, this, I just feel like I just from the the animation, I feel like I run so much faster than the Tarans do. It's kind of nice. I mean, I feel like I run fast. All right, and Ace of Cloud Singer is done. Challenge of compassion and humility by helping Richard Lorvo. It would seem you have passed, Monk. Master Shang will be pleased. And, yeah, complete quest, and the missing driver. Alright, so we have a Cloak of Compassion. Cloak of Compassion, and we have a neat Emergent Satchel, which is a smaller bag. We get a cape now. We're Super, we're super Panda. Super Panda! Ooh, Initiate's Vest, that's nice. It's much better armor than what we have now. Totally didn't know what we're supposed to do. Oh, Protector. Okay, up in the cave, if you would... Why can't I jump like that? Protect her while she meditates. This should be fun. Not sure what's going to attack her, but okay. Fu's Pond, the Dawning Valley. Cave of Meditation. Discover Cave of Meditation. Whoop. Creatures, keep it bay while I'm intending. We'll have we'll soon have the answers we seek. Okay, this tiger this tiger claw or whatever it's called is really nice. And we uh, almost constantly have chi, so I should be reading the uh, <laughs> the voices here, but I, I'm so co I'm fo so focused on fighting these things that I'm time to read them. It's nice. To, it's, it is nice, kind of having to to fight everything with our button presses, and also having the buttons inside my mouse and my Razor Naga is really nice too. And there we go. Should be too much more now. That does so much more damage too. And so our our path lays before. Us. Speak to Master Shengzi. He will tell you what comes next. Thank you. Dang, this old guy moves fast. Holy cow! How did he get here? Complete quest. Another of my most talented students is awaiting you in Wong's in Wusong Village to the northwest. He is of a different mind than Asa, but in their differences, they bring balance to each other. G Firepaw will instruct you on gathering the offerings for the fire, Spirit of Fire. Trust in his wisdom. Speak to G Firepaw of Wusong Village. And we'll do that. That'll give us. Aren't we looking awesome? Most assuredly, we're not. We're not looking evil. No, not at all. Really debating joining the horde <laughs> if it hasn't become a apparent already. Uh, then again, the horde's not really evil; it's just a difference of opinion. 
in a severe wanting to kill the Alliance. All right. Also, something I can't wait for level 20 is the ability to get a mount. Speaking of which, how much... Oh, we have five silver already. God. I feel like I'm so poor in this, because I've got like a th I've got a thousand, like, thousand gold, which is actually fairly poor on my, uh, my warrior. And I keep, I keep complaining about... Whoa, 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 that's weird. I got caught underneath that. Uh, I keep complaining about not having a lot of stuff, but it's a level, it's a level two character. Oh, level, not level two, level three character. I mean, seriously. Take that, butt monkey butt. <laughs> what? Hello, you look poised and confident. I like that. I've heard some rather impressive whispers about you from the training grounds. If you have as capable as they say, I'm taking a lot of damage. Uh, complete the quest. This guy is not being nice. God, these guys are... Oh, they have they have money. Okay, let's get his quest now. We called the, vict the vicious monkey swinging in into a town hose and... Listen, they keep to themselves normally, but they know something as bad is coming. So they they are here to steal our supplies. In this situation, the answer is clear. The only answer is clear. These monkeys will leave when for forced to kill eight Feifeng attackers. Feifeng brew thief. I have... Alright, there we go. Yes, that's right. Give me your money. One Feifeng attacker down. I have a hundred percent of threat now. So what's this guy fighting? It looks like he's fighting his stove. There's one. And yeah. Tiger Claw. Off my head, stupid monkey. All right, you did. There we go. Got that copper. Okay, it's four down. Let's see if we can't drop some more of these guys. Build up off Archie. And then Tiger Claw. We leveled up. All right. Let me get our next abilities. Let's check that. All right. We just got Tiger Palm. Roll is level five. Roll is resistance. That's gonna be nice. Looks like every other level, starting at level three. Need some chi. He's dead. All right, how many more of these do we need? It's two more. So there's a good two over here. Yeah, these bruzy. I like these bruzy because they're easy to kill. <laughs> Seven down, one to go. Okay, we generate two chi with that jab. It's kind of nice. All right, it's all eight attackers. Let's go return to uh, where are the Huojin. Return to G Paw Fire to G Fire Paw in Wu Song Village. Uh, I do I do love running quests in these games. I don't know why, but for some reason this g Blizzard really knew what to do when they made this, and they let's see, fanning the flames. Strange thing about wind, it can be hard to wrap your hands around it. Best practice for me is finding some sort of living wind. If it can punch you... Oh, son of a gun. Uh, head over to the Shrine of Summer Breeze and South and summon such a living wind when using this windstone. Best best, get, best to gather a fluttering breeze from it. Alright, so... We'll work on getting the rest of his stuff in a minute after we kill this Fefeng Hosen. I don't particularly like getting attacked while I'm trying to read things. Okay, now that that's done with, let's get to, let's get to it then. Uh, 
Huo, the spirit of fire, hungers for dry dogwood root kindling. It grows among the trees to south of the village. It should be easy enough for you to gather some. Dry, gather ten dry dogwood root. All right, we have to go down that way anyway. So this way it is. Really, you gonna attack me? The brew thieves. It's not fun to get attacked by a bunch of guys that I can't insta kill. <laughs> Try to un un ignore those monkeys. All right, I see some roots now. They're all over the place. Excellent. Dry dogwood roots. Two. All right. And three. Oh, come on. This must be the windstone. We'll uh we'll do that once we gather this dogwood. We only have two more pieces. One after this one. Foe. Oh, you son of a gun. Don't you jump on my head, monkey. Get off my head. Get off. Get off my head, you stupid monkey. I will murder you. You don't scare me, monkey. I eat monkeys like you for breakfast. Well, not really, because I'm a panda, and pandas only eat bamboo. Oh, there we go. There's the last one we needed. Dry dogwood roots. All right. Now let's summon the wind spirit and best it so we can, or not the wind spirit, but the wind uh, elemental, I guess, and then best it so that we can summon living air. Oh, we can throw lightning. That's not fair. I'm also wondering, if it's living air, how am I hitting it? Fluttering breeze, awesome. There's the last thing we needed. Let us head back, and after the, these couple quests, and killing some more monkeys, because they're annoying the living crap out of me. There we go, he's dead. This appear to be lagging just a little bit. Not like frame rate lag, but like your normal kind of everyday in-game lag. But yeah, I think after these quests, we'll finish episode 2. So yeah, hope you guys have enjoyed. If you did, don't forget to like and subscribe. And uh, we'll go ahead and finish that uh, kind of outro out when I get over to this NPC to finish the quests. Oh god, let's try to avoid the monkeys. Oh, son of a gun! Complete. To new. Complete. Okay, we're gonna we're gonna kill the freaking monkey real fast. So he gets off my head. Okay, there we go. All right, so the next quest is for Master Xing Zi, but we'll do that next time. Hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, don't forget to like and subscribe, and if uh, if you haven't already, of course. And uh, yeah, once again, uh, thank you guys for watching. It really means a lot. And this is Gravion signing out.